So I wanted to do a really easy midweek dinner with these lemon sole fillets that I got from Bernard Corrigan. So I'm going to do them in papillot. You can use grease proof paper, but you need to make sure that you get a really good seal. I'm going to use kitchen foil just because I'm lazy and you can ensure that that seals like 100% because in papillot basically means we're steaming the fish. This is the cooking method within the oven. So preheat your oven to 200 and we're going to get our foil ready. So foil. I've basically got two bits about the same size and what I want you to do is lay one down and the other down like that and across, okay? So we're going to build up what we're going to put in the parcel just here and then we're going to use another bit of foil to seal it all up. Next is preparation of the ingredients. So I'm just going to put the spinach on the bottom. I want you to get a handful of parsley and chop that up finely and a couple of garlic cloves as well, just two should do it. Um, one for each parcel, one for each bit of fish and chop them up finely as well. So I've just put the garlic off to one side. I've got a, bit, a little handful of parsley and I'm going to chop that finely as well. We keep it separate just so you can put half and half in each parcel. I'm also just going to slice a couple of slices of the butter to place on so you'll see it when I'm putting on. So I'm going to assemble this. I'm going to put a bed of spinach down, the fish on top, a couple of slices of the butter, and then we're going to sprinkle over the parsley, garlic, and also some fresh cracked black pepper. If you don't have like salted butter, I'd recommend some salt as well, but this has sea salt crystals in it. So there we go, we've got the bed of spinach, with the lemon sole, I put two little slabs of butter, garlic, parsley, and fresh cracked black pepper. Get yourself another bit of kitchen foil, and then we're just going to seal it all up in a parcel. And there we have it. And we're just going to do the same with the other one. It's a really delicate, thin piece of fish, so it doesn't need long at all. Once your oven is preheated to 200, put it in, I'd say for eight, max 10 minutes. So that's been about nine minutes by the time I pulled my finger out after the timer went off. And the joy of the papillot, you can eat it from within and just open it up. And enjoy. And I'm probably gonna serve mine with potatoes and green beans.